protect your DNA. BioPQQ can promote formation of new mitochondria. InfoWarsStore.com I'm Joe Biggs with InfoWars.com here at the University of Texas in Austin. Now, there's a trend going around college campuses nationwide. It's all the new rave, post-birth abortions. A lot of you probably have never heard of that term. I know I hadn't until yesterday. Well, post-birth abortion is after the baby is born and up until five years old when it's able to make decisions or is self-aware, you can still kill the baby. Now, I know that seems shocking, it seems shocking to me, but there's a lot of college kids around the country who agree with killing babies up into the age of four or five. So I came out here today to find out whether or not UT agrees with post-birth abortion. Let's go see what happens. A lot of people, they have uh, botched abortions. You know what that is? And what this is, is a post-birth abortion act of 2014, if you want to sign it or not. But you can take a look over it and Stephanie, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Thanks for signing the Post-Abortion Act. No, I can't support stuff like that. Why can't you support stuff like that? Because that, that sounds awful. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. All right, well, thank you for being that way. Hopefully more people agree that. That's the, more, the more the merrier. All right. The more we can help empower women. Hey there, how's it going? Hi. You want to help empower women? I'll just sign it. You'll just sign it? Okay. Well, it's all about empowering women. Okay. Um, no, keep talking. I'm just signing a paper. Nice suit. Seems like you're hot in there. Nah. You look cool. You look cool. Yeah. Well, at least I'm alive. I made it. Yeah. <laughs> Unlike these babies who are going to die. For this. But in what context? Can I read it? Uh, Post-birth abortion. Women who have botched abortions, sometimes they fail, and it's to give them the, uh, the ability to go in ahead and go through with it after the baby's been born. Uh, so first of all, I can't even, I don't even have a comment on this because it's ridiculous. Hey, so I'm glad you made that decision. Thank you. Because guess what? You have three students that go to the school that think that's a good idea. You might want to talk to some of your friends around here. What is it? Uh, it's to give women the right to have abortions. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sign away. Yeah, they're just post-birth abortions. Okay. So basically, a lot of abortions get botched. They don't uh, work. Yeah. And the baby gets born anyway, so it gives the mother the, the opportunity to continue on with it. Um, it's to help uh, give women the right to make the, the decision to have a, a post-birth abortion if they want. Post-birth. Yeah. That uh, means if there's a botched abortion attempt and it's still born, that they can still do it right away. Okay. All right. It's just a post-birth abortion. What does that mean? What does that mean is if there's a botched abortion and the baby's still born, they can just do it right then, terminate immediately. They're not doing that. No, that's wrong. An abortion if they want to or not. Don't sign that petition. Ask what you're signing. I already know what I'm signing. Thank you. Look, there's a camera up there, and I'm making sure that you're not an evil person. Look, you have a lot of students here. That's freaking ridiculous. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Like, who would sign that without, like, what? No, guess what? There's people who read this that says they're going, they're allowing kids up to five years old to be killed. What? No, look, this came out in the college Please fix. Please tell me that you do not agree with this. Oh, of course like, not. I have a huge issue with no. this. Like, no, that's really why we're out here. You're making me so angry that people are signing. Like, these people are horrible people. Yeah, and people all why? over. It's, it's the, embarrassing. No, it's not. You should feel that way. Okay. You know what breaks my heart every time someone signs this thing? Oh, man. Okay. So thank you for being a good human being. I appreciate Sorry. it. Yeah, high five. What's your name? Mila. Mila. Nice to meet you, Mila. Do you uh, support abortion? Yeah. Okay, well this gives uh, women the right to have post-birth abortions. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can look it over if you want, or just sign away. It's up to you. So what are you going to school for? Um, nursing. Nursing, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. 
What are you going for? What? Look at you. What are your aspirations? Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna be honest and tell the truth and nothing but the truth. So help me God. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's what we need. All right. Thanks. Just making sure I'm signing the right thing. Good luck. Thank you. All right, I gotta write this down. Future politician. I'm just reading it. Yeah, cool. Check it out. Okay, that's really weird. What? The person that signed before me has the same last name as me. How you said Bainter? Yeah. She's gonna be a politician. You're gonna be a musician. Got it. You already, you already got your schedule. Seconds. Come on, just sign my petition to give women the right to have abortions if they want to. Come on, hey. It's okay. post-birth. Okay, Brent. You want the best that's out there at the lowest price anywhere? Well, we're bringing you a total win-win. The ultimate value, cutting-edge, trailblazing game changer that also supports the info war. We have produced a limited run of DNA Force, and it will take up to 12 weeks to produce more once we sell out. Secure your DNA Force today at InfoWarsLife.com or call toll-free 888-253-3139. DNA Force from InfoWars Life. InfoWars.com live election coverage, November 4th, starting at 6 p.m. Central. Interviews, analysis, and results. Go to PrisonPlanet.tv or watch the free streams at InfoWars.com forward slash show.